I survived. Um, I got my little smoothie. I'm out in the middle of nowhere outside of Stillwater. I'm still in Payne County. I've never driven out this far, but. I just wanted to drive around and drink my smoothie and listen to my podcast. I'm listening to dr the first episode of Drama Queens. I know I'm so late behind, but it's so good and I knew I would love it. I just have been listening to other ones and I finally have time. Anyway, tomorrow I'm going on my friend Allie's podcast and a new episode of my podcast will be live. I am literally about to turn around at the next like spot because I have homework due tonight that I have to go finish. It's a it is it's an Excel worksheet. Um, so I've done most of it. I just have like four or five things I need to fix on it. So I'm gonna do that and. Then I, well, before I do that, I have to go to UPS. Um, well, I'm gonna go to my apartment first, then I'm gonna go to bed. I have to go to my apartment first, and then I'm going to UPS, and I'm gonna run by Sprouts. Um, I have veggies, I just need some meat, and I might get one of their, like, casseroles. So, yeah, that's the tea on that. <laughs> Bubble and Amazon, so yeah, let's just get into the diggy diggy. I have a stir fry mix, I have two little snack cheese and fruit, I have Rice Krispies but gluten free, I have cheese, I have this. It's my favorite, like pre made thing that you just pop into the oven, it's just creamed spinach and kale. Um, I got halibut. Nope. 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 I got haddock. Um, that I'm gonna cook for dinner tonight. These are my favorite things on planet Earth. They're so good. So good. I think they're gluten free, but I got them anyway, so. Um, I got these to try. Cauliflower hash browns. I'm gonna cook one tomorrow. Um, oops. Favorite chocolate in the world. It's so good. Shout out. My aunt showed me these. Um, white sour cream. My favorite cereal. This is my favorite gluten-free cereal. I like the light version of it, but oh, they did not have it. Um, I got two peaches and these little enlightened bars. I also got package from Amazon. I know what it is. It's these little stands. Oops. 
They're like pink. Oh, this is gonna take a minute. I'll just show you when I'm putting them up. Um. <sighs> what I'm most excited for, besties. Oh my gosh, this is the best feeling in the world. I love red bubble. Cute, cute, cute. Wait, maybe I should tell the backstory. So basically, um, I ordered these because I got, I ordered a Tink's um, Simple Modern, and I thought, you know what's a fun idea is to add stickers and make it my little dream, like manifesting, like vision board cup, because I am using it like almost every day. I clean it, no worries. Um, so yeah, so these are the ones I chose. <laughs> Okay, first we have LA. This is actually for something else. Um, I got LA. I got clickbait. I got first I'd like to thank the Academy. And then wait. Is this the right number? One, two, three, four, five. No, that's right. I thought I ordered another one, but I guess I didn't. And then I got this one. And Lisa Renna, it says, why am I here? I'm more fabulous than this. And that is the tea on that. So yeah, I'm gonna cook my dinner, do my homework, and I'll catch up with you guys later tonight. Okay, so I'm making my coffee. It's noon. A little, a little thing called insomnia has decided to come visit me. Um, sorry, that's my coffee machine. Also, it sounds about like my laptop when it gets overheated after doing like one thing. Um, basically, I have always had like really really bad insomnia like I probably had since I was in high school but when I was in college it was like really really bad um and like when I was struggling like mentally and like drinking a lot it used to be like really really bad like I would stay up till like 4 a.m almost every night and um whenever I like it happens every time I come back to school or like I switch schedules and so yeah so yeah um i just haven't been able to go to sleep at my normal time it's noon i shouldn't drink espresso but i have a call at like 6 p.m so i need some form form of caffeine to be able to be a good guest on this podcast so um, and I was supposed to edit my podcast and upload it today and I had homework last night and that turned into a whole other thing. I had like this mental breakdown because I'm in like a buy a like retail math class and I just, I've never been more confused with what I'm going to use my degree for in my life. And so I'm trying not to stress about it. I talk about it in my podcast um so i was like like last night after i finished my homework and stuff i was like i could stay up and do home more homework or i could do something that's going to kind of like distract me so i edited a video and um went or tried to go to bed and i couldn't 
so I just um, I just cleaned <laughs> for like probably an hour and a half and yeah I just <sighs> Hi Queens, what's up? It's Editing EA. I just wanted to say that I always feel bad putting any sort of complaint in because there's literally so much going on in the world and everyone has their own issues, but at the same time, like my issues and my feelings are valid. So for the first time in a really, really long time, I'm just fully putting out like how I was feeling in this moment. This was like two weeks ago now um, and or it was a week and a half ago. And now I'm feeling like so much better and I feel really good. I just literally had like a little breakdown and everything's good in the hood now. Um, and just trying to give myself grace. So yeah, if you're struggling out there, um, my friend and I, Allie, talked about it on her podcast episode that'll be coming out soon. Um, but, you know, just remember everyone's going through the same thing as you. It's not just you and like you're not alone and like get help or like reach out to who you need to reach out to and yeah anyway okay bye queens you guys it's later um the only thing i've accomplished is going through and kind of so when you do a podcast or when i typically do podcasts with Allie, she'll send me an outline and whenever i have guests i'll send them an outline um about like what we're going to talk about questions whatever Anyway, so I've just been going through that, but I'm just like getting, I'm getting so like genuinely excited to go to New York City. I'm so excited. I have a feeling when I go, I'm going to have the same feeling I've always had my entire life, which is I belong there. So just to furthermore, like draw out my crisis, my quarter life crisis, love that. Anyway, I'm going to order these shoes that I saw. We're going to see if we can find them. Because I want, like, I bought these Reeboks, and they're great. But um, they don't, they, they're not the exact look. And I think I'm going to order these Converse. They're, like, plain white. They're not the ones with the um, red stripe. I used to have those. And Converse, like, you can wear them all the time. And I used to wear them all the time. So, yeah, I'm going to get the plain white ones to wear on the trip. I have this outfit. I'll show you guys. Oh, actually, I showed you guys in my last vlog. It is um, this, like, banty. And I'm thinking that shorts and Converse for one day outfit. I only need to have, let's see, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. Yeah, I just need three outfits. So, and then, of course, I'll have, like, outfit changes. But anyway. So I'm going to try to find it because I can't find them anywhere. Hi queens. I'm feeling so much better. Um, I know I look like crazy. I just finished doing a workout and cooking my lunch. Um, I think I said this in a couple <laughs> videos ago. But I was going to get the hot honey from um, Whole Foods. And right now I'm regretting it because it would have been so good on my meal I just made. Um, I didn't use regular honey. But I'll show you guys. Also I... Um, I'm going to eat and chill for a minute. I'm feeling a lot better, so yay for that. I'm going to, oh, I have to go get utensils. I'm going to watch The Modern Family. That's one of my favorite TV shows, if you guys did not know that. Um, I love Modern Family. I've watched it from, like, the very beginning. I don't know why. My camera's autofocus is, like, not working very well, so fun um and i'm just gonna watch a uh, episode of modern family eat my lunch drink my water um shower and get ready for my podcasting and then i'm going to edit my podcast upload it and do my homework so yeah i'm about to record with ally i'm going to take these books in there to stack up because it records better right there it records better here i'll actually there it records better if um you're like closer to the phone and so i have a little thing in there that i'm gonna put it on top of so yeah <sighs> i'm just taking some deep breaths i'm just like so anxious and i don't know what for um i'm really hard on myself when it comes to school for literally no reason 
um i just always am like freaking out during the school year like you need to do that you need to do this you haven't done this you haven't done that and there's really no reason i should be freaking out it's not like i like have all these assignments that are late or anything um so i'm just getting accustomed to get back in getting back into school anyway i'm gonna fix my water you guys i'm literally obsessed with all my stickers <laughs> yes okay well i'm gonna do this because i'm gonna be late if i don't hurry up i'm just gonna put you guys there while i record I'm recording a podcast with Allie for the next hour. Hello. I'm good. How are you? No, you're good. I was like, oh my gosh, mom. <laughs> um, not really. Other than if you hear something, it's me like chugging my water. <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh, I love every time I get to come on your podcast. It's so fun and I just love listening to it. Queens, I just finished. Here, let me fix this. Ooh. Hi, Queens. Um, I'll put you up here. But you'll probably fall so yeah this is my outfit i know my hair looks like psychotic but i'm not changing it so i'll show you guys in here i'm sorry i just realized i hadn't vlogged all day um it's like 12 30 i have to run to walmart um really quick and then i'm running to school and then i, I might stay on campus a little bit to do some homework but yeah i'm just wearing this i got it at urban outfitters my Spanx biker shorts they're my favorite biker shorts literally ever and I think I'm going to wear my white Reebok shoes and then a mask of course <laughs> and I might, I might put some earrings on but I'm not putting any makeup on I just have my like regular skincare on so yeah let's just get into it all right I'm ready taking my new Bag. I still don't know where my camera bag is, so I'm gonna have to leave you guys here because I don't want to mess the camera up. So. My car says it's 113 degrees, so I'm gonna go get a Starbucks today. Yeah. <laughs> if you were curious how that went, um, imagine the Legally Blonde scene where she goes to class and then the teacher's like Maine, except for my teacher was not Maine, and she like is like, I'm dropping out of law school. Yeah. Me right now, so. I'm out of breath because I just climbed like five flights of stairs, so 
funsies. Hi, queens. Oh my god. I just. <sighs> oh my god. Alright. I know I look like horrible. It's just. I, oh, my like stomach hurts, I'm so anxious. I don't know why I'm like, I'm like fine. I just am so like. I just don't know what to do. <sighs> I'm fine. I'm gonna go for a walk and kind of clear my head. And I never like put this kind of stuff in my videos. I like always end up, up cutting it out, but like I'm gonna put this in just because I know like I'm not the only one struggling with this. And I'm fine, like I'm so blessed. And it just sucks because like I thought that I knew what I was doing with my life and exactly what I wanted to do. And I'm just so confused now. I have no clue what I'm going to do when I graduate. Or even like what internships I'm going to start applying to because I'm I just like I just don't know. And I don't have to have it figured out now. Like, it's only August. It's almost September. But it just sucks because the things that I thought I really was going to like in merchandising and fashion aren't. <sighs> I'm literally, like, fine. I just, like, needed to cry it out for a minute. Hey, how y'all doing? <laughs> uh, very different, like, mood I'm in. Um, yeah, basically I was having a breakdown because, like, a bunch of stuff at once. I, like, I get homesick when I'm here sometimes. Like, it's not all the time. Um, but usually, like, the circumstances are... That I can go out and do whatever I want and fill my time up, which I am filling my time up with school because I'm so stressed out. But I mean, like, fill my time up with going, hanging out with friends, going out, doing all this stuff. But it's like COVID, so I can't. And so that's how I usually distract myself, <laughs> distract myself from my homesickness. And I can't do that. Um. Anyway, all that to be said, there's like that. I just like miss my parents and um. Just like going through the changes going from like being close to my parents and from like having a stable routine for the most part um and anyway so <laughs> going from that to here and i'm just i'm not stressed out i just am starting to see the things i don't want to do with my degree and realizing like i wish i would have 
you know gone to school or done a program that had the creative side as well and not just like the buying um of merchandising and like i would have liked to do like a class or two on like filming or photography and i didn't <laughs> um and i don't even think that our school offers that so um if i could go back to the beginning i can't i would have done something like a fashion degree and minored in like film or production or whatever because i'm really interested in creative like creative producers and like fashion and ph fashion photography and fashion videography um so yeah um but there's nothing i can do you can't change anything and yeah so i went for a hot mom walk and i walked for literally like 45 minutes um and i listened to a podcast which really helped me it was tinks i know i talk about tinks literally all the time i talk about her like 10 times on the podcast i just filmed yesterday um or recorded yesterday but like she uh she was recording with mad the people who do mad happy and it was i mean her advice was good too but they were just talking about um how like in the program like people like grown like older people say how jealous they are of um like people who figure the things out that they figured out later in life and i like kind of i talked to like a mentor and she was saying the same thing like you're 20 for almost 25 and you've like figured all this out at this point in life you don't have a family and that's what he was saying you don't have a family you're not tied down to anything you can do whatever you want um and and yeah so that's um what I, they were kind of talking about and i was just like giving myself a reminder and i'm totally okay i just like had a mental breakdown just like a little breakdown i talked to one of my best friends from home um and she like was just telling me how proud she was and we were just talking about like old me and everything and um yeah i'm just grateful to be where i am i'm just gonna keep going i can't give up now and just finish my degree even though it's hard and I'm so confused at what I want to do with it. Um, and that's what Tinks was talking about too that really like reminded me was like you want like you should count um, failing as big as a blessing um, or a gift as succeeding because then you know like that's some that's a job you don't want to do. That's whatever you don't want to do. And so yeah, so changing my perspective to gratitude. Um, so yeah anyway i have to go to the school in the morning because i accidentally left my flash drive and then i'm gonna go to arkansas so tonight i have homework i really need to do um i have let's see what else do i have of homework i need to do i have something due at midnight that i forgot about and it is 8 20. um but that's okay i'm gonna clean I'm gonna pack my like non-perishable items in a bag and I'm going to pack my bag, which I don't really need that much. I literally just need like two outfits and um, leave in the morning to Little Rock. And I know that'll be really good because Little Rock always helps me. Um, and plus it's my family. <laughs> um, so yeah, I can't wait to see my brother and Jan and Clyde, my little puppy therapy, even though he'll make me sick with my allergies. Um, I'm just praying that I don't get like too sick from my allergies. It happens. I'm allergic to dogs, if you guys don't know. Um, <laughs> and so I'm also allergic to cats, but um, knock on wood, like lately, the cat hasn't been what doesn't bother me as much. So I'm hoping it's the same way, but I'm just gonna take my Benadryl and my allergy medicine and pray, pray, pray. My own assignment to pray for Elizabeth's help. Amen. All right. Talk to you guys in a little bit. Oh, I went and got in Chick-fil-A and right around and I'll insert a clip from the sunset. Back yourself a
<laughs> How y'all doing? My tank is Amazon. My pump is Medtronic. My leggings are Lululemon. And my shirt I'm about to put on is Trap by Truckers. One of my favorite bands. My eyes are swollen shut. Please look at them. I'm puffy from crying all day yesterday. I wanted to sleep in and I shouldn't have because my blood sugar was low when I woke up. It's been low literally every morning so I'm trying to get my settings right. Um, I could just wear this without a shirt but I'm gonna wear a shirt. I might take it off though if it's too sweat, I mean if it's too hot in the building. I'm going to school. Um, I feel absolutely horrible about myself, how I feel. Um, I feel better about school. I talked to my professor, but um, yeah, I don't feel well, and I'm breaking out, which like is like duh. Um, I'm not going to Little Rock anymore. <laughs> I just can't do it uh, unless like something crazy changes. So. Um, I'm just going to do as much homework as I can today. I'm going to go to the computer lab because it's easier for me to do it on the Mac, but I can do it remote off my laptop. Um, and I really want to, um, just start like working and toying with different things because, yeah. Anywho. Just want to show you guys, I'm almost done. Basically, I'm just gonna talk for a minute and then end off this vlog and give you guys an update. So maybe I'll go sit over here. Basically, it was just kind of like everything at once. Um, yeah, I was just stressed out from school, like just feeling overwhelmed in general. School, navigating, like being sober in my college town. Um, COVID and just honestly really homesick. So yeah, that's what happened. I feel a lot better today. Um, and I'm feeling a lot better in general with school and everything. I just am at that point where A, I'm ready to be done, but B, I'm just very confused at <laughs> what I'm gonna use my degree for and where I see myself because, um, and like I went on a walk yesterday and it helped a lot and I think I talked about it. Yeah, like Tinks was talking about we should see like everything as like that's not what we want to do as a success um and i did i just like needed to talk to my dad and i literally talked to my dad for an hour like sobbing uncontrollably sobbing on the phone with him um shout out dad and i feel like so much better i was just i was filming feeling so overwhelmed and it's like normal like Emma Chamberlain was talking the other day on her podcast about like everyone um like we've been in a pandemic and everyone should show themselves she didn't say grace but like grace um for surviving surviving this pandemic and it's not over and <sighs> I don't know, I just like had a moment of just like not feeling posy wazzy vibes like I usually do. So yeah. Um, but I got up today, I did homework literally all day. I went to CVS, got some health stuff, and then I went and grocery shopped. And you guys will see it in the next video because I just started a new vlog, um, sort of. But anyway. My battery's dying. I'm doing so much better. Um, I'm happy. I just was kind of like in a little funk and needed that. 
big cry session so yes um i just wanted to post this because i wanted to show that like not every week is a good week and everyone has their struggles and yeah so bye queens